Good morning. So this is your girl Gypsy. If this is your first time seeing this video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Today, uh, I don't know why my flash is on, but we're gonna work with it. Good morning. It is currently not you too. It is like 8.59. We are going to go on a trip today to find some items because Valentine's Day is around the corner in case y'all didn't know. Valentine's Day is around the corner in case y'all didn't know. So um, I obviously have a four year old. So I'm thinking like what's cute? What's, 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 what's the creative idea I could do for my daughter today? Well, to prepare for Valentine's Day. And I was like, you know what? Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. So we're gonna take a trip to Dollar Tree and find some ideas or some activities that we could put together for Valentine's Day that'll obviously any toddler can do. And I'm sure I'm not the only with a kid out there. So let's make this fun. So we're gonna take a trip to Dollar Tree, get a few ideas, a few items. So when Valentine's Day comes around, we have plenty of stuff to do. We all know Dollar Tree sells candy. Whoop whoop, that's cool. But we want to get creative. You know, make little wreaths. Maybe some little flowers. We'll see when we get there. Um, I gotta go get ready. As you know, your girl is disheveled, as usual. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and get myself together, brush my teeth, and we're gonna get on the road. And I'll see y'all in a minute. Let's do this. All right. So here's the fit. Very cute. Um, this is from Walmart. I, I, I don't know. Maybe I got the wrong size, but I don't think the pocket's supposed to be up here. I guess my boobies are too big. It, it is what it is. And I got the little um, pants with it I'm gonna wear my actually no I'm gonna bring my purse with me <laughs> actually I could I might bring I'm gonna, I'm gonna wear my Uggs today and I actually haven't worn my Ugg handbag so I uh, see look still wrapped up I haven't worn this at all so since I'm wearing my Ugg shoes the little fluffy boots I wear a lot um, I do have some boots but I haven't worn them yet I'm actually gonna bring this purse to put my phone in and then my other purse in case I grab some stuff. And we're off. Alright y'all, so I am on my way to Dollar Tree to see some goodies. I'm specifically going to a, uh, a certain one that I know usually is clean and stocked up. There is one that's a little closer to me, but it's on the other side and I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it to myself. I never had to travel all the way over there for disappointment. I refuse. I rebuke Satan in the name of Jesus. <laughs> I'm not going there. It's huge, but on uh, the side of town it is. I you know I'm gonna be looking through stuff. I'm gonna be sifting, trying to find what I need, and I'm not into it. The counters are never clean. Stuff is never put up where it's supposed to. People drinking stuff and putting the bottles back. Like, mm, I love y'all, but not today. Not today, it's so. Um, so, I'm on my way there now. Just see what they got in store for your girl. I don't think this will be a really long video. It's honestly just me taking you guys to find some cute stuff to do at Dollar Tree for your child um, or for your spouse. I've gotten a little, um, I've gotten a little comfortable with filming in public a little bit more. Um, not like out crazy with it, but I have got a little bit more comfortable like filming and just like not caring that you're staring. Because <coughs> I already deal with people staring at me. So I was like, yeah, and I really just, at least this gives me a little bit of comfort to know that they're probably staring at me because I'm filming. Versus, oh, they're probably staring at me because my butt's be or I'm cute. I like the way that that gives me a little bit of a diversion to assume that that's what they're staring. And it also helps me because now I can just walk away like in panic. I do it a lot actually. I'll film and if I see someone staring at me, I just, and then walk away. Like I, like I was doing something completely illegal. <laughs> it's hilarious just watching them confused and um, trying to figure out what my motives are in life. If, if at all if there are any motives if i just woke up today and was like i want to just go go film a rack at walgreens there's no motive she just she just woke up with a camera and went to film a shelf at a grocery store 
this woman knows where she's going in life. I'm telling you, tune in, stay focused. <laughs> All right, guys, I will see you in a minute. Um, I'm literally just driving right now. There's really nothing to watch, and it's raining outside, as you can see through my wonderful moonroof, sunroof, whatever you want to call it. Moonroof. <laughs> Logan is right next to it. The rolls. The rolls are so damn good. I'm really like. Logan's had some great rolls. Oh, I'm supposed to stop. Now I gotta wait long. Oh my. <laughs> my air pass soon gonna die. It just beeped. It just beeped. I heard it. It just beeped. It's gonna die. It's gonna die. Oh my god. My air pass. Oh god. My entire, uh, I'm so anti-social. <laughs> it's gonna die. Nigga, do you know how to drive that marker? The hell? I'm gonna go find I don't know if I got a burp or if it's just stuck there. I feel the air pocket. Deep in my offices. Deep in my offices. I mean, why is she walking like that? Coming on the altar. Oof, that price tag, huh? Oof, she got a crumple. Oof, I got the parking lot. It's empty with her. Yeah, I don't know. See, I'm early and no one's here. I love it. Let me film in peace. My ear, my ear pod just died. Oh my god. Now I gotta get the other one. Mm -hmm. I take a part close to the entrance. Yay! We are here, you guys, and I'm about to take you inside of Dollar Tree so we can find some cute activities for you and your child to do. Um, give me a second. I have to regroup my AirPod dot. And you're like, what are you listening to? Honestly, nothing. I'm just, I'm just <laughs> I have my other phone, and I'm just listening to um, a, a podcast, you could call it, I guess. I don't know. It's honestly just like someone talking in my ear, and it soothes me. And I got me some coffee from my previous stop in my other vlog. Ooh. Ooh. Tastes a little funny with the with the, with the gum. <laughs> it was like a little confusion. Hold on. Oh, there it is. Okay. All right. <sighs> I gotta put on my, um, what do they call it? The zebra insurance guy. Oh, look at people going to Logan. I know that's right.
sure how we got to Easter so quick, but and it's mostly Easter stuff. They sell some cute items. These are cute for your porch. And of course they have squishies. Lots and lots of squishies. some aren't this is in a really good uh nice area hold on i got kudos from someone hold on oh bitcoin chill vibe anyways so this is the asshole area and they had some items and then I'm just like, oh yeah, I'm looking for something different, right? I don't want like the stereotypical, just candies and things like that. And I actually did find some stuff that I'm gonna go ahead and use. It's gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and just give my daughter the um, the paint set. And I'm gonna use that and I'll be okay with that. Um, she, that's something that she can do all day, baby. And then we can take a nice hot bath and be out of the light. And I'm gonna go ahead and give me some wine. And I have HBO, so <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but that is my lot times. So wine, um, some hot cocoa, and HBO. Your girl is definitely a 90s rom-com kind of girl. 
throw on an overboard, throw on um, the First Wives Club, throw on Boomerang, baby, and I am yours. <laughs> so that is honestly my typical Valentine's Day. Um, now, I, I wanted to find men's items, but then I quickly forgot how a lot of stores don't really, like there's nothing, everything is stereotypical, right? Like I'm not gonna buy you a shaving set, I'm not gonna buy your beer kit, I'm not gonna buy you a toolbox, because men have other, you know, hobbies other than that, besides being a man, if that makes sense, right? Why would I buy your shaving kit? That's literally something you should probably already have in your counter. Yeah. So that didn't make much sense to me. Thank goodness I had a great light. I'm gonna have to figure out this uh, setup really quick because you're like in front of my vision, so I'm doing double vision to drive. So um yeah, anyways, they didn't have any like items to carry towards men. Like if I was to date someone and I know they're like they're into like Star Wars, I'd probably just buy something Star Wars or things like that. So maybe not the best for shopping for men because everything in the store is very stereotypical. Um, we all know. You know, men have. Ah! We all know men have beards. We all know, you know. No. So if whatever your man likes, go and just get that directly. Don't try to be creative. If he's like my daughter, for example, and likes to paint, then I got a place for you to go to. <laughs> but as you saw in the previous vlog as well, even grocery stores carry like cute little items that you probably would sleep on to get for Valentine's Day. And this is just a time of the year where you can go crazy. You don't have to be stereotypical. You don't have to be boring. You can literally a spa set up from Dollar Tree. Like Dollar Tree is up in their brands now. Like did, I, did you not see the face, the collagen facial treatment? Okay, Dollar Tree, <laughs> you know? And so is the grocery store. The grocery store is actually more creative. Be well, depending on who you are. But honestly, you're at the grocery store. There's nothing more romantic than that. <laughs> no, but seriously, listen. You're at the grocery store. You, a, a romantic meal. Google a quick recipe, okay? A quick, cute, cute little sexy, you know, spaghetti or stromboli or shrimp alfredo. Go get the ingredients from the grocery store. Get a cute little paper bag. Um, get a cute little paper bag. Put the ingredients in there. Put the recipe, res you know, uh, instructions in the recipe. Come on. Come on. You cannot fail with your girl. You cannot fail. <laughs> but that is our trip to Dollar Tree to find some cute items. Like I said, Dollar, Dollar Tree is full of all kind of stuff. But I wanted to go outside of the box. I'm not trying to get stereotypical hearts and chocolates. I'm going to go ahead and just get my daughter the paint. The paint set the paint drawers and signs and have her go crazy because the children love those things and it's valentine's day once it today's not valentine's day obviously so i'm going to go back later and get those but when valentine's day come i will update you guys and show you her little her creativity set uh, <laughs> until then i hope you guys tune in i'm on my way back home now love you guys make sure you comment uh, comment subscribe tell me how your valentine's day is going or how it is going girl or if you're prepared just like it girl I hope to see y'all soon. Love y'all. Bye.